Hey everyone and welcome to Top Think. Today we're going to learn about 15 psychological facts that will blow your mind. Now let's begin. Number 1. Mental Rewrites Imagine you're trapped in a boring meeting. <sighs> You've been sitting there listening to your boss drone on for hours. You do anything to stand up and walk out of the room, but you're supposed to be paying attention. So, how do you stay engaged when a monotone speaker is putting you to sleep? Well, it turns out your brain automatically rewrites boring speech patterns using something called an inner voice. Your inner voice basically translates every piece of language from the outside world into your head. So, when you're excited or interested in something, your inner voice doesn't do all that much. But when you're bored, your inner voice helps you stay awake by spicing things up. If, for example, while you're sitting in that boring meeting, your inner voice is continuously talking over your boss, it's replacing his monotonous speech with language that's more meaningful and engaging. So, next time you're stuck in a boring lecture, pay attention to all the rewrites that your brain is making. Number 2. Guilty Empathy Do you have a strong sense of guilt? Do the smallest mistakes weigh on you for hours or days at a time? Guilt is often framed as a major character flaw, like poor self-esteem or a bad temper. But a 2016 study discovered that people with a strong sense of guilt have a certain set of social gifts. Well, for starters, they're extremely empathetic. Researchers found that guilty people naturally sympathize more with other people's troubles. So if you have a strong sense of guilt, you're great at putting yourself in someone else's shoes. It may not always improve your mood, but empathy is a rare and a valuable trait. People with a strong sense of guilt are also more ethical, generous, and mindful of others. Overall, they're some of the most pro-social people in the world. So, don't let anyone make you feel guilty for feeling guilty. Number 3. Social Complaining Okay, no one likes to admit it, but we've all complained about our teachers, bosses, and co-workers. We've all ranted to our friends about some frustrating thing our colleague did wrong. But how much of your time do you waste complaining? Researchers say the average person spends over half their conversations complaining about something. One study puts that number as high as 80%. So the next time you catch yourself complaining, think about how much of the day you've spent letting off steam. Number 4. Overestimating real-world crime Are you a fan of crime dramas and cop shows? If you are, there's a good chance your perception of the criminal justice system is a little bit skewed. These crime shows are designed to be exciting and dramatic. They feature severe, often terrifying crimes that leave viewers on the edge of their seats. But as realistic as they seem on TV, those crimes are a lot less common or even possible in real life. Number 5. Music Affects Global Perception A fast, catchy song will give you a boost of positive energy, just like a sad song can put a damper on your day. But music doesn't just influence your mood, it changes the way you perceive the world. In a 2011 study, researchers had participants look at pictures of emotionless faces while listening to different kinds of music. They discovered that uplifting music tricked participants into seeing smiles that weren't there. In other words, that happy song wasn't just making them feel good, it was physically altering the world around them. But it wasn't only the happy music that changed their perception. Dark and gloomy songs had a similar effect, transforming emotionless faces into scowls and frowns. So, if you're the kind of person who walks around with headphones in, your music might be changing more about the world than you realize. Number 6. Measuring Awkward Silence We've all experienced an awkward silence. You might have run out of things to talk about, or maybe someone made a bad joke that killed the mood. Whatever the cause, I think everyone can agree awkward silences are the worst. In fact, some people avoid conversations altogether just to escape that few seconds of unwelcome silence. So, how long does it take for a pause to turn awkward? One study found that 4 seconds is all it takes. 
After those four seconds, the flow of the conversation is ruined and the mood takes an obvious turn for the worse. Number 7. Seafood Reduces Alzheimer's One particular kind of food can actually help you fend off neurological disorders. A 2018 study discovered that people who eat seafood regularly have a lower risk of dementia. These findings held true across all ages, genders, and income levels. Now, you don't have to eat a pound of fish every day, but a little salmon every couple of weeks can do your brain a whole lot of good. Number 8. And Unfriendly Attraction Have you ever noticed you pay the most attention to the people that ignore you? Maybe it's someone at school that you look up to, or a coworker who just won't give you the time of day. Why is it that we always want something we can't have? Well, it turns out your brain interprets their unfriendliness as a goal or challenge. You obsess over these people in the same way you'd wrestle with a challenging math problem. Number 9. Scared of Numbers There are quite a few bizarre phobias out there, like the fear of hair, houses, and bathwater. But few revolve around something as simple as a number. Triskai decaphobia is the fear of the number 13. Whether it's the 13th floor, the 13th step, or the 13th door, Triskai decaphobics steer clear of them all. This phobia might seem a little strange, but it's much more common than you'd think. In fact, millions of people in the world are scared of the number 13. It's so common that many planes and hotels remove the number 13 from their rows, elevators, and hallways. Most of these business owners aren't actually scared of the number 13, but just in case it's bad luck, hmm, they don't want to take the risk. Number 10. Self-Disciplined Toddlers Delayed gratification is something we associate with productivity and self-control. So many people don't practice these healthy habits until their 20s or 30s, but by then, you're pretty late to the party. The truth is, you can learn self-discipline when you're only 3 years old. Just look at the famous Stanford Marshmallow Experiment. A group of kids, all between 3 and 5 years old, were tasked to fight their urge to eat a marshmallow while the researchers stepped out of the room. Many of them failed. But a good chunk of these toddlers had no problem staying in control. Even though self-discipline helps you the most later in life, it's never too early to build healthy habits. Number 11. Constant Wandering How much of the day does your mind spend floating through space? Uh, well, a lot more than most people would like to admit. Some researchers estimate that the average brain is idle for about 30% of the day. Even if you're at work or in school, you'll waste a huge amount of your time daydreaming. Number 12. Negative Recall Imagine your friend walks up to you and says, Can I ask you a question? What kind of thoughts pop into your head? The vast majority of people start thinking about every bad thing they've ever done. Your friend might ask you a perfectly innocent question, but that doesn't stop your mind from flooding with negativity. Number 13. Questions mean creativity. How do you know if you're a creative person? Natural curiosity is a foolproof way to tell. If you're always raising your hand in class or bombarding your friends with questions, well, chances are you've got more creativity than you know what to do with. You see, natural curiosity means you're discovering mysteries and exploring new avenues. If you ask lots of questions, then you're making all kinds of connections that go beyond the obvious. That's the kind of innovation that's critical for any creative mind. Number 14. The Power of Monotony How does repetition affect your brain? What happens when you do the same routines every single day? Well, most people don't realize that consistent practice alters the shape of your brain. As you hone your skills, your mind will get physically sharper and stronger. Well, just take something everyone does, like language. The more words and phrases you learn, the more neural pathways you'll form. 
all the parts of your brain that deal with language will be activated over and over again, which helps them develop and mature. Yeah, I know that doing the same thing each day can get a little bit boring, but every round will spark something amazing inside your brain. Number 15. Healthy Relationships Lengthen Life When you think about avenues for a healthy life, what comes to mind? A fulfilling career, diet and exercise, maintaining good habits. Relationships aren't usually on people's lists, but they couldn't be more important. Several studies have found that people who build strong friendships and relationships live longer, happier lives. These bonds even reduce your risk of developing a number of diseases and disorders. In other words, spending more time with your friends isn't just fun, it may even help you live longer. Hey, thank you for watching Top Thank, and be sure to subscribe because more incredible content is on the way.